incredible natural disasters. How long were the railways going west effectively closed? How did you handle it? Yeah, so a large majority of our product goes westward to Vancouver, and that rail line was shut down for more than two weeks. What we did was we had to reroute traffic to our Portland terminal, which is also in the west coast of the United States, but um, but they you know, can only take a certain amount of product. And what we also did was we rerouted traffic to our St. John terminal. One of the things that we did was um, we, we normally service Asian customers through Vancouver on the west coast or through Portland, but again, we didn't have enough capacity to Portland to take all the product that would have come from Vancouver. And we actually moved vessels from St. John through the Suez Canal, across the Atlantic Ocean, all the way to Indonesia and Malaysia. That's a journey of 10,400 nautical miles and a massive increase in the journey from what it would normally take from the West Coast. So not only do we we run 40% increase in ocean voyage, we you know more than doubled the land and distance as we, we took that train from Saskatchewan to St. John. So that is a massive amount of commitment we make to customers to ensure when there is a disaster, we have the ability, we have the choice to, to take their product to them through a different, a different path. I'm just picturing your thought process as you had to make some of those calls through the fall here, the summer and the fall. What was going through your mind as you're going, okay, yep, send it through the, through the Suez Canal? Yeah. And, you know, for us in operations, what we really think about, what our company thinks about is how can we best serve the customer? So there's an immense amount of responsibility to take those actions and to incur those costs to reroute literally around the world in a different fashion. But it is that commitment to our customers that, that keeps us, that keeps us positive through those times. And it is our responsibility to give them product on a reliable basis.